this is the part 2 of the Creo perfume model and we are going to model, model the lid right here and we will be using the same technique called freestyle okay Okay, so we're going to use the sphere. Let's bring that up here. Okay, let's put it in the right place, which is here. And we're going to make it from the top down. So let's bring this up. Scale it. Okay, so just play around with this, make it in the middle, there you go, that looks a lot better, now, okay, so, okay, so the top bit's a bit smaller, what I'm going to do is, make an extrusion okay so I'm gonna make each s the, the segment to be at where the curvature change so we're gonna go put this down and I'm gonna hide the other one so I'll just save that there and, and hide my other model first so right click suppress suppress will hide it hide your previous model and we can work with this one and I don't want to show the shadow okay we are ready to work with this one we go edit definition and okay let's quickly work around the shapes okay okay we need this to be a bit smaller so, so when you start just keep the shape simple work on the details at the end so just make the main changes now so it should be more smaller okay there you go should should be around something like that and now it's gonna extend in so we're gonna extrude again so there's a change in curvature here when when the the lid goes down it starts coming in, starts coming out, starts coming in. So each of that we're gonna have a a um what do you call that? A section, a section area. So whoop, let's not do that first. And scale it first. We're gonna scale it smaller. Extrude it down and scale it out. It's a good idea to adjust your back image so to keep your design accurate, keep the design intent to how you like it. Because the video, I'm gonna make it quick, so I will just quickly go through this tutorial quickly. And we're gonna extrude it down all the way to the bottom. And scale that in. Okay, bring it to front view. All right, now we're gonna work to make it good. Oh, 
we we'll use five split to make it nice make the end more clean and bring that front view okay, bring it up like right there that should be a bit more scaled that should be up a bit more let's put it in, in, in all in the right position okay that goes there it goes up a bit more it should be there that's there that's there and that's there and now we will adjust we we'll scale each part and make it in the right area so looks about right so far it just be to be more be more scary here and yeah, that looks about right okay it looks fine to me and um, so for your one you can spend more time making it look better but this is more about showing the technique so Okay, let's bring this forward front view. There you go, that's right on top. Okay, I'm happy with that. There you go. Now I'll just change the material, see how it looks. Okay, shaded view. Okay, render. Okay, how do I add the material? Okay, you go to render, we can pick a material. I'll just make a red. I want to select the whole part and there you go that's how it looks and we're going to show the other bit okay so there you have it um, I think I suppress, suppress the other file and it just disappeared should be still there but it's gone so I, so that's all I have left here that's just the lid but I'm just gonna keep it going like that. So that's the tutorial. You can it's all recorded there, so for you to look at. So that's the end of the tutorial. If you have any question, leave a comment. Uh, make sure to subscribe and like my video. Have a great day.